if I save one more time at this save spot and start the video here, I swear I'm gonna go insane. Thanks. Anyways, hey kid, I was next to here, and welcome back to Lisa. In the last episode, we went to Wendy's. It was pretty scary, and we lost Buddy again. And now we feel like shit. So we need to go do something about it, I guess. Which I don't know what, but we'll figure that out when we figure that out. Alright, so I remembered. We have to freaking go this way. Because that's where we stopped off. And blah, blah, blah. This is going to be fun. Is there anything past us? No, there isn't. I don't know what this is about. Are you one of her friends? Poor girl. You're the only one that's shown up to the service. Oh. I don't think this is a part of the thing. Yeah, this is something else. Her coffin. Who is it? Oh, what the fuck's happening? What the fuck is all this garbage? Oh. Okay. Oh. Not this theme again. <laughs> oh, what's wrong with the theme? Oh no. Who are you guys? Let me save right before I talk to you. I already read the dirt sheets. This is this is yeah, this show is gonna suck. Pro wrestling is forever. Even at the end of the world, it still thrives. It completely fulfills the primal need for violence and glistens bodies. Or in glistening bodies. All humans have this need, only few are willing enough to accept it. Pro wrestling combines the thrill of life sports with the drama of storytelling. It's a perfect art form. Oh boy, I'm gonna have to participate, aren't I? Who are you? Sorry, hombre. This bed is for wrestlers only. Oh, it doesn't look like anyone's in there. I mean, not. I don't want to join, dude. You interested in wrestling? <laughs> Fuck it. Fucking love it. I run the EWC, Inter Internal Wrestling con con Congregation. I think you can. I think I can use you. How about I put you in a match? Since you're new, I want you to lose, but put on a good show. <laughs> How about it? Okay, great. Let's see you in action. Remember to lose. And now, welcome to the ring. Wonder Wizard. I always rise to the top. I am the cream of the crop. Oh, yeah. So, I have to... Do... I have to fight him, but pretend to lose? Okay. Okay, I'll just do the surprise attack, I guess. Oh, damn. Do this. And we'll do... Epic. Oh, wait, we have Joy on us, so we can't even hurt him. Please don't kill him. Oh, I can't even do it. Oh, it's SDD, isn't it? Oh my god, this guy does like no damage to me. Don't kill him. I can't even use my specials on him. Dude, this battle's gonna go on forever. Why can't I even use it? I don't know why it's just not moving. This is gonna take forever, so... Oh, come on, how did that not kill me? What? Alright, it's better than I kill him. Oh my god, don't kill me. Yeah, there we go. Brad was defeated. All right, we won. Looks like we have a winner. Wonder Wizard is on a rampage.
Well done. You may have a future in this business. I think we can give you a push. Come speak to me if you want a match. Okay, so this is cool. So can I talk to you yet? Rest here? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, I'll rest. Hey, we're cool kid now. We can rest here. Epic. I could continue fighting, why not? Doesn't seem like anything negative's going on. What the hell? This is a single match type for the Eternal Belt. Uh, this is a tag team champion. She'll be tagging with Shock Lord. He's a failed gimmick that we put a lot of faith in. On this debut, he completely tripped on his face and ruined his entrance. Ever since then, he can't seem to get over it. He can't ever get past his ring entrance. This match type is just a big brawl. You can even bring your own guys into it. You can totally grind here and work on teamwork. Okay, I'm gonna do that one. It's okay to lose in this match. You won't gain any experience if you do them. So buck up. Oh, so I can fight. Get ready to run. All right, boys, let's kick their ass. Fireball three's ass, so. I killed Bill Pistler. Okay, we got our objectives. Who's this? Oh, I used the wrong one, whatever. Damn it. Flurry. Burn you. And he's gone, just like that. That was a good attack. Alright, so these guys are pretty weak. So we'll use Armstrong on you. We'll do that to you. That to you. Nice. I don't know why I keep using two instead of three. Ooh. You draw a skewer and what? There we go. That's the Boink. Oh, they killed him. Uh oh, he's gonna kill a G. Oh, do that. Do that. What did we get? Critter clamps, big stampede. Alright, I'll do that. Yeah. Six six six, bro. And missed? Oh man. Hey, that was good. This should finish him. Wow, none of it finished him off. Alright, this should finish it off. Yeah. Ooh, that is some good grinding. Big bad knuckle drop, alright. Finger beam 2, and that's about that. Damn, that was some nice grinding. Looks like we have a winner, Armstrong and his boys. That was a good fight. I could low-key grind here, that would be a nice idea. But I'm not gonna do that right this second, I don't have any need to grind as of now, because I'm pretty good at my levels. So, I'm just going to 
try out this one. <laughs> By the way, you lose in this match type, and it's you lose in this match type, and it's game over. Losing your push in wrestling is worse than losing your life. So do your best. Oh boy, today's Brad Armstrong gain his tag team partner. Who could it be? Oh, don't fall again. It is I, the most powerful lord of wrestling, the most shocking superstar. Shock Lord. Oh, he fell again. Shock Lord. And their opponents, the bill collectors. Hey up, suckers. Shock. Alright, big shock it is. I believe in you, bro. And he got paralyzed almost instantly. Well. I can take these guys on, so I think I'll be fine. They seem to be just beating up on him, so I think I'll be fine. That's one of them out. Shock Lord's back. Don't kill Shock Lord. Oh, damn, Shock Lord did it. What's the point of getting XP for Shock Lord? Is he gonna join me? Looks like we have a winner. Alright, let me heal up. Now eternal champion. By the way, you lose in this match type and it's game over. Losing your push in wrestling is worse than losing your life. Let's do this. Alright, so it's a single battle, right? Today, Brad Armstrong, the fresh young face from Oath, takes on Biscuit and Gravy. Rawr. Rock and roll will never die. Hey, Biscuit and Gravy, you look funny. But, I believe in myself. Power bomb. Oh damn. Alright. So, what we gotta do... Is head slide. Hey. Fuck. That was not G. Oh, I messed it up again. Don't hurt. Oh fuck, that did hurt. Hey. All right, there we go. Oh, Brad, I knocked him down. That's all I had to do. Looks like we have a winner, Mrs. Armstrong's baby boy. This guy's getting hot, folks. Keep an eye on him. Ah, good match, Jack. I guess that's it. Oh, I won all of the matches, so that was cool. Uh. I think I'm done here though. I thought there'd be some kind of reward, but it doesn't look like it. So, I guess it was just worth the fun. Oh, I beat that, so I'm gonna keep on yelling. So that's where I wanna go. This is where I can go. Ah, yes. Take some soup. What's up, dude? Hello, Traveler. You like that wrestling shit? I think it's so stupid. Tough. The Devil's Machine is rumored to be a semi truck. It's by the cargo that the true. It's the cargo that's the true mystery. Okay. Oh, it's a shop. I haven't had time to stock up on items in a while, so I'm glad. Hey, brother. You best not go beyond this camp. The devil owns the rest of his land. What's with them and the devil? I want to know what's inside the devil's machine. It turns he it turns humans into freaking mush. What could that? What could do that? Oh, uh, that doesn't sound good. It's a luxe sunscreen, dandy hat. Picnic blanket. <laughs> so 
dandy hat's better. Fur coat. Okay, so I'll buy two of these. And now I'm poor, so that's cool. Rando poncho, where did I get that from? Alright, we'll sell they don't need. And we'll sell what else they don't need. Guess I don't need these. Guess I don't need that. Or that. Or that. Or that. Alright, so now I got a ton of mags. And I can continue buying stuff. So we'll buy you sunscreen. Okay, so you still want this, huh? Buy that. Now we gotta optimize that. Boink. Oh, I shouldn't have sold that or sold that. I'm an idiot. I can buy one of those, and then I could just go and earn another one. Or maybe I could sell. Oh my God! I think I can. Yeah, I can. Wow, lucky me. I had just enough money to do it. What? Oh, defense goes down, but special defense goes down harshly. I'll take it. Okay, are we good here? Yeah. What other random things could I sell? Let's get rid of you. Has duffel etched on the side of it. What the hell does a duffel bag do? I don't know what it does, but how much does it sell for? Eh, I mean I could sell it, but I feel like it might be useful later. So I guess that's it for now. This is a good thing to buy. If you throw this can at someone, it won't hurt. Alright, I'll buy one of those. Hey, buddy. If you have a death wish, you'll continue on. I'm seriously not fucking around. The devil's machine rests beyond this point. If you enter the machine, you will never return. Your body will be mutilated. Nobody knows what's inside the machine. We just know that nobody returns. Ah, smart man. Yeah, I don't want to go there just yet. What do you think, Harvey? Should I rip this guy to shreds? But he has no t title belt. He's not worth my clothesline. Get out. Okay. Oh, why did I go up here? Well, ouch. Alright, I'm gonna go back to that cave, and then I'm gonna go and see what this devil's machine's all about. This place looks fun. Okay. This place is no music, so it's a good sign. There's a save point, which is also a good sign. That whatever is up ahead... Oh no. That's one slippery girl you got there, Brad. She's tough, that's for sure. All that isolation did her curious mind some good. It's over, Tony. Heh. <laughs> Haven't heard that name in a while. That's what my dad used to call me. That's what. That's why we clicked. You were the only one that understood what it was like. We used to be so alike. Poor beaten, poor beaten, fucked up kids. Except I kept my chin up. You fell down. You don't have an excuse. Not with me. All this stuff with Buddy, it's bullshit. 
what happened to us, what happened to survival, to brotherhood. I don't care about that anymore. Buddy is my daughter. She's my second chance. Huh. Get real. She was a gift to the world, not to you. She's not your child, you fool. Face it. You're just no, not man enough to do what, ne what, yeah, what needed to be done. But don't worry. The world is safe. I made sure of it. No. Whoa. He's still alive? Brad. Please don't hurt him. Please. I'm begging you. Kill them, let them live. Fine. I'll let them live. I'll be compassionate. Get up. Leave. Don't ever show your faces again. Thank you. Let's go, Sticky. This isn't over. So, damn, my friends turned on me to work for Rando now? That's so fucked. Dude, that's messed up. I would have killed them, but I'm compassionate for the series. Uh, I kind of want to go see what the Devil's Machine's all about, though, now. Since this is the correct path, that is the alternative path. So I'm going alternative. I pray for you. Oh, boy. It's a lot of death by the Devil's Machine. Goddamn. Am I supposed to go down the other way? Because I don't want to take fall damage. So... Okay, yeah. Playing it real fucking safe there. <laughs> Jeez. Alright. Scoot down here. Oh... Is this the devil's machine? Doesn't seem to be a way in. The fuck is this? So it's like a truck. Okay, well I can't go in it, so I'm just gonna leave. Guess there's nothing then. Or at least I can't go in it for now, but that definitely looks like that's gonna be plot heavy later. I see you up there, buddy. Don't know what you're... Well, oh, great. Did you have a nice reunion? I thought you'd want to see your pals, so I let them live for you. That reminds me. Do you know this little girl? I do, all too well. I never wanted her here. It's no place for a girl, but I guess she can be a useful tool. Maybe now I can show you what it feels like. What do you want? That's nice. You're learning. Shut the fuck up. Just tell me what you want. Bradley, I'm shocked. You really are changing, but you still haven't suffered enough. You used to be so joyful. These people are holding you back. You're better off alone. I want them all dead. Or her nipple. I'll cut it off. That's fair, right? She has two after all. It's not a tough choice. Fuck. So they cut off her nipple or I kill all of my friends? I can't kill Terry though. Is that guy holding a gun? Holy crap. Brad. That was really dumb. Oh yeah, I forgot I can't beat this guy no matter what I do. I can't beat him, I forgot about that. Don't do that again. It's all a waste it's a waste of our time together. Now choose. <laughs> I really don't I can't kill Terry, but uh, she <sighs> Not bad. Wow. Tough kid. Here. Here. Here, you keep it. As a reminder of your accomplishment. Now then, we should be going. Bye, friend. Oh, Do I have a nipple in my inventory now? Do I have a nipple in my inventory? Why am I able to equip it? 
reminder of your choice. <laughs> Who would ever need to equip it? Also, I just got the hell beaten out of me, so that was great. Is there a way for me to save after that garbage? Yeah, I don't want to do that. Alright, let's see what this is about. Well, that was quick. She got away. She's impressive, I'll give her that. It's always the sweetest fruit that comes from the most rotten loins. She would have been a real asset with the women. What are you talking about? It doesn't concern your kind. Brad, I've been working very hard with you. I'm glad you've been taking joy. I quit that shit. It doesn't matter at this point. I've made sure of that. And... It's a good thing. I get to play with you longer. But, no matter what I do, it still hurts. You haven't suffered enough for what you did to her. Oh boy. Your other arm. Give it to me. Or give me your possessions. Your magazines, your clothes, items, all of it. Can you survive without them? What is more important to you? Cut it off, take it all, why are you doing this? I could do that one, but I'm gonna do... <laughs> Fuck it, he could take my items, honestly. Honestly, he could take my items, because I could just get them back, and I'm not losing another arm to this man, and I don't even care about what he has to say to me anymore, honestly. Remember, you deserve this. He took all of Brad's stuff. Oh. Oh. He didn't take everything, actually. I still have my shit. Oh yeah, everyone has all their stuff. Okay. But he did take all my actual items, which sucks. It's your arm. Tough. I got an achievement for that. Is there a save point? Oh, it's Farty. Dude. Oh, wow. Hey, Farty. Nice seeing you, bro. Anyway, I'm Tardy. And I guess what? The girl stole my boat. She sailed to the island to the far right of us. It's unbelievable how resilient she was. I was completely overpowered. Now, I do have a brother who had a boat, who has a boat, but he couldn't possibly make it over here. The waters are too rocky. But, if we can build a new boat, I can take her, take you to her. I just need some wood, a sail, a way to propel the boat, and tools to put it all together. You get all that, and we got a deal. So get to it. So now you gotta build a boat. And we got a bunch of places to go. And a guy that's selling items. So I guess in the next episode, we will take care of this and get to Lisa, which escaped to an island. I'm sad that I made her lose a nipple, but you know what? This game's already enough fucked up. That's a that's not that bad compared to what it could have been. So I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.